Hi, welcome to US Most Read, streaming now are the five leading stories of the day. Newton and Menow, the former Federal Communications Commission's chief in the early 1960s, is dead at 97. The pioneer who was instrumental in revolutionizing the satellite communications and the quality deliverance of TV sets, who even received the Presidential Medal of Freedom in 2016, breathed his last at his home on Saturday amidst his loved ones. His famous lines that network television was a vast wasteland remains immemorial. Dallas, Texas is shell-shocked with a massive gun shooting incident, killing at least nine and leaving seven others injured. The incident is reported to have taken place at a suburban Dallas outlet mall on Saturday, where an unidentified man began firing on people walking on sidewalks outside the outlet center. With this incident, the mass shooting toll touches 200 marks so far in 2023. Talking about the most adorable twinning moment during the coronation ceremony that soon became a viral content was the mother-daughter duo of Kate Middleton and Princess Charlotte. The silver headpiece, leafy design using a mix of silver, crystal and silver threads and a gorgeous Alexander McQueen dress and cape were matching perfectly. The silver work that was featured in the crown comprised of the rose, thistle, daffodil and shamrock plants which was in connection to each country that makes up the United Kingdom. A much speculated move was taken by Bronny James, LeBron James' son, when he decided to play basketball for University of Southern California, USC. The message was transpired via an Instagram post where James shared a photo from inside the locker room donning a uniform with the number zero with a text reading, fight on and committed. This move of committing himself to the Trojans or Ohio State and UCLA brings him closer to home in Southern California, where his father, Lebron, plays for the Los Angeles Lakers. Prime drama series SWAT gets cancelled by the CBS Entertainment after six seasons. The star-studded 1970s cop show will air its final episode on May 19. Amidst the speculations behind the cancellation, it is learned that the ratings were not the reason, as the show garnered an average high of 6.82 million viewers over seven days' time frame. It was the current economics of the TV business which made the CBS take this decision. As most networks and streamers are prioritizing full ownership of their series. Well, thanks for staying with us. We've added this new segment of covering five leading news of the day. If you have liked it, please do like, share, and subscribe our channel. With your support, we'll keep on improving. Thank you.